Hi, I'm Ainsley Tanner, here with more tips to help you get to the top of your game in your career, sport, and business. Now, I often hear from people that one of the things they dread most at work sometimes is dealing with conflict. People say they don't like dealing with conflict, they don't know how to handle it. It can be a really challenging kind of situation for people. So today I wanna to share with you a question I find really powerful for getting you out of that kind of drama-focused, stressful state where all we can think about is the problem and we're not sure how to move forward into a more solution-focused mode that moves us into a higher level strategic thinking mode. So the next time you're in a challenging situation, think to yourself, what's the story I wanna be able to tell about how I handled this? What's the story I wanna be able to tell about how I handled this situation? And I find it really useful to just imagine myself in a future interview situation because it's not uncommon for an interviewer, for example, to ask about, tell me a time when you experienced a challenging situation and tell me how you handled it. And so thinking about that kind of future situation and the story I'd want to tell there about how I handled it, how I showed up, I find really useful because it really breaks me out of the moment and gets me focused on well, do I want to come across as collaborative? In that case, what would illustrate that? Um, who else would I have talked to in the situation in order to come up with a solution? Or if I want to demonstrate that I'm courageous, that I don't shy away from issues, well, what's the courageous thing to do here? What's the courageous thing to say? And I use my answers to these questions to guide the action that I take. So the next time you find yourself in a challenging situation, I'd encourage you to just think, what's the story I want to be able to tell about how I handle this? and see what new insights that helps bring up for you. I hope you found this helpful. Thank you so much for watching.